so if you're new here thank you so much for clicking on the video and if you're not new here thank you so much for coming back and being everyone this is gonna be a get to know me tag for all my new subscribers and just for people who forgotten who i am we're gonna get into a few questions in a moment but i just want to show you guys my makeup look that i did in less than one hour which i actually tried because i've not been doing makeup for a very very long time back a bit because my dress is causing a bit of contrast with my life the first question is what is your name my name is Nataiza Namutami um, when is your birthday my birthday is on the 19th of November what is your zodiac sign so I personally do not believe in zodiac sign I have my own reasons why you don't have to agree with them but for a person who's born with the range that uh, in the dates that uh, align with the zodiac sign for some of you i believe to be somewhere placed as scorpio uh what is your height apparently i am only 1.6 meters or 160 centimeters i'm not that tall i've been like this for the longest i can remember because i remember getting my passport back in 20 um uh, when is my passport? Uh, back in 2015, 2013, somewhere there? I don't know. When is my passport? I don't know, but it's been like five, six, seven years back. And I was 1.6, and from there, I've never, I've never become taller. So I'm 1.6. Um, sexual orientation, I am a female, as you can see. There's nothing confusing about that. Um, eye color i think it's black i'm not sure if it's black or brown you might not see it well here birthplace i was born in lusaka zambia apparently for those who don't know fyi i was actually born in the house um, i find it is pretty cool i find it pretty cool that i was born in the house like oh my my religion of course is christian um you know what it's been like two minutes in this video and no one told me that i was not using my microphone so i'm going to continue from here my religion is i'm a christian follower of christ um i have a few nicknames that people have given me and the most common one is nati so nati or nad i just pretty much would love if people just pronounce my whole name as natasia but I do understand it's kind of complicated. So Nati, Nat, Anti Nati, whatever you feel you like, just do it. But just be respectful. Have you been to a concert? Yes, I have. The only concert that I clearly remember going to is the Fireboy concert in back in Zambia. And I have a video about it. So if you guys want to watch it, I'll put the link here or here, wherever you're going to find it. Please tune in and just entertain yourself. Have you been to the beach? Yes, I have. Not in Malaysia though, but I've been to the beach in South Africa and Tanzania and Zanzibar. The most recent was Zanzibar, but it's been like five years since I went there. Um, have you been on an airplane? Yes, I have. Have you been arrested? Never. I'll never be arrested. This is not my calling. It is not. It is not what God wants for me. So I will never be arrested. I have never and will never ever 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 ever. Have you ever broke a law on purpose? Um, I've never been summoned to any court or any um, police station. So I believe that I've never broken a law. Have you ever been out of your country? Yes, I have several times. I am well traveled and that is that have you ever met someone famous yes i meet myself every single day because apparently i am famous but <laughs> i'm just joking yes i have met somebody famous and yeah do you have tattoos no i do not have tattoos uh do you have piercings yes i do i have one on my left one on my right and um apparently uh i want to get more on my ears i'm thinking of getting one um i'm thinking of getting one up here and also maybe here just like here or another one here i am not yet decided because i am literally scared i'm also considering getting a uh, 
nose piercing do you smoke no i do not smoke do i drink um i take wine so is wine considered drinking that's the only thing i can take because i'm classy sassy here doesn't want to fight me <laughs> no but um seriously i take wine and the wine that i prefer sweet wine it can be alcoholic it can be non-alcoholic but all i know is that whenever i take something that has alcohol substance it makes me sleep i also enjoy hunter's gold yeah hunter's gold too is my go-to and it does nothing to me honestly so if it's not that if it's not hunter's gold then i am chilling with uh wine which i also really take do you do drugs no i do not um do you have pets yes i do have pets but let me tell you i'm very scared of the dogs at my house we have them they're ours but i'm scared of them for some reason do you have a job uh yes i do are you married no i'm not married but i do hope to get married in the next couple of years in less than five years i should be married um that's if it aligns with god's plans for myself my life whatever his will is but i do want to get married as soon as possible <laughs> do i have a crush uh at the moment i don't think so maybe i do mm, no have you ever been in love i have been in love before um longest relationship my longest relationship has been three years and a few months uh, but i will tell you something i have never had a relationship that um did not make it to a year or 10 months that's just me i am a long-term type of person so i take relationships very seriously i just find people who don't respect that and it makes me sad when i have to actually start learning to cut them off or live without them but yeah i take relationships very very seriously and it's something that i feel let me tell you one time i went to i went to sunday school and i've not been to sunday school in a long time and the day i go there i was talking about relationships and uh our teacher tells us that if you're gonna date somebody make sure you date to marry that person and every single whenever i heard that i took that personal so i make sure that i learn stuff i don't give up on people but people just don't change and they're okay with that so we move and that's about that so my longest relationship is three years and close to four years if i'm to be honest close to four years best friend yes i do have a best friend which is um wait do i have a best friend i don't think so i am my own best friend at the moment because i understand myself better than anybody else <laughs> first kiss uh, um, i think it's my mom who kissed me when i was a baby that was my first kiss if it's not my dad then and it's because i was an infant i was a toddler i was a baby i was a new but if you tell me like collectively what i can remember i think i had my first kiss even when i was five years old if i'm to be honest have you ever been cheated on yes i have several times and i kept on forgiving and now i don't forgive cheating have i ever cheated um it's embarrassing to say but yes i have and i had reasons for it if that makes sense a best date idea would be to be honest at the beach um bring those uh picnic baskets bring the mat bring wine and let us look at the sunset whilst talking about love <laughs> yeah that's the best uh, that's the best dead idea anything that has to do with nature i am there because i can get to connect with you and at the same time feel god's presence that's how i look at it celebrity crush i have no celebrity crush to be honest i oh i kind of think that dan uh danzel washington is uh handsome as well as idris elba so maybe yeah body count when you talk about body count i have never engaged in this i'll say zero can you play an instrument yes i can um i can play the recorder apart from that i can but at the back of me i do have a guitar which i actually want to start learning how to play can you play any sports yes i can i'm actually an athlete if you if you want to put me in that box i do play soccer i do play basketball and this uh, volleyball too and netball sometimes so yeah i'm a sporty person 
Do you speak any other language? Yes, I can. I can speak Nyanja. I can speak Bemba. I can speak Tonga and English. A apart from English, those are the only three languages that I can actually speak fluently and with a little bit of confidence. Favorite band and song? I am in love with Little Mix. That's the only band I listen to. And my favorite song? I kind of have a lot, but it's Confetti. That's my favorite from Little Mix. Um, favorite movie and actor? Oh my god, I love the Titanic. And there's no favorite actor. Oh, one of my favorite actors actually is uh, I forgot her name. Tiffany. Wait, what? She ah oh, Taraji 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 Taraji. Yeah. Um, color favorite color is turquoise blue. Favorite food lasagna. Sometimes shima. Um, um, with some uh, chihuahua like vegetables uh, cooked with groundnuts i love that and some chicken or beef or sausage i love that favorite tv show i used to enjoy a lot of disney tv shows but i moved from that and right now i actively don't have a favorite tv show but i will tell you that i was a huge fan of dance moms bring it lifetime was my favorite favorite animal a lioness i got this from my mom when my mom told me that her favorite animal is a lioness i literally picked it up and made it mine ice cream flavor i love anything that tastes like bubble gum yeah and also the oreo type of ice cream i love that favorite place london of course apart from that my favorite place is my bedroom like right now this is my favorite place to be in the entire world because i can literally do anything it's my comfort zone but paris too would be a good uh place the maldives too so beautiful i really want to go to maldives and yeah anything that gives island island that's where i want to be right now favorite book i don't right now i'm reading uh i think it's good vibes uh something like that i will show you guys that's one of my favorite books right now i'm learning so much from that book favorite application right now is tiktok if i'm to be honest tiktok is my favorite application nobody can top tiktok oh youtube too <laughs> right sports team right now i know we're gonna say you only support um this team because no i've been supporting this team for a long time arsenal and man city catch me there do i want kids in the future of course i do but unfortunately i only want to have one kid i've never seen myself being a mom to more than one child in my entire life i've never even planned that before but at the end of the day it's god's plan but i would love to have kids yes one would be ideal but if more come then it's the lord's desire because they'll be working in the house of the lord best believe that dream place to live i would love to live in dubai um if not dubai then i'm thinking of london uk turn off uh, oh a lot of things turn me on uh, intention of people turn me on uh food turns me on Ooh, service when you act uh, when you're of service to me it turns me on when you buy me stuff that i saw little but then if i talked about it and you listen to the conversation then you go on and do that that turns me on it's like oh my god listening understanding and just action turns me on action that is right and that is healthy to me it turns me on turn offs cheating lying failing to put boundaries with girls drink people that drink to the die people that drink people that do not establish boundaries with other people especially if you're a guy i that turns me off people who lie especially when you know the truth and they're lying it turns me off ish i think a lot of things that turn me off are relationship wise but if you talk about friends people who can't stand up for me it's a ten of people who can't defend me when i'm mine when i'm not in the room it's a ten of honestly because what are we doing at this point what are we doing at this point where are we friends i defend my friends so i expect you guys to defend me too being dirty people who smell bad people who've got a bad smell it turns me off people who who do it turns me off actually um favorite position um i don't have a right position um do you masturbate <laughs> oh. um i don't but i'll be lying if i say i have never done it threesome never in a million years i'm a one man one woman type of girl 
and i value monogamy uh pet peeves i have a lot of pet peeves a lot my pet peeves are so much i'll just have to have a video about my pet peeves because yo a lot of things pet peeve me but one of the things i'd say is my pet peeve is uh, a lying cheating man that's my pet peeve it irritates me it oh another thing that is my pet peeve is girls or women that do not value themselves women who do not have shame in their bad manners that is a pet peeve a woman who doesn't have shame a woman who who looks at um infidelity as something that's okay it's a pet peeve it's it it grosses me out I think another my pet peeves are relationship wise bad habits oh i have a lot of bad habits if i'm honest and sometimes i eat without washing my hands i just and also i hate washing my hands after i eat so these are my bad habits that i can think of right now my lucky number is always gonna be 19 because i was born and i believe that i was lucky and blessed to be born on the 19th so that's my lucky number leaving ghosts um Yes, I do believe that ghosts exist and the way I believe in them is that a ghost is a person that died but the spirit is still alive and it's hovering and I do believe that those things exist. But they'll never come near me, they'll never come near my household, never come near my family, never come near my marriage. They'll stay where they stay and they'll never bother me because I'm not looking for them and they should not look for me. Obsession or addiction, I would rather be obsessed with something than addicted to it. I guess talents i have a lot of talents from to be honest i can dance i can uh, to be honest i never know what is a talent and what is a hobby because the next one is hobbies um hobbies i think are things you like to do i love to listen to music i love to sing um those are my hobbies i like to play a sport i like to skip i like to jump i like to run randomly i'll just start running uh, I just have that in me and if you go to talents I would say I'm I'm athletic I'm talented in sports I can run I am I would also say I'm yeah I think I would say that's my talent I can do makeup it's just a talent um, there's a lot of things that I'm trying to improve on as talents I want to develop some talents um, but yeah, I can also dance. Dancing is also a talent for me. And yeah, this is the end of my video. Thank you so much for tuning in and meeting me here, taking time to watch. Don't forget to share this video with your friends. Like, of course, subscribe, comment, um, recommend to other platforms. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.